Hey everyone, welcome back to a new episode of another brick in the mall. So if you haven't watched the last episode, we built a new store here, which is like a music CD, a DVD, like a, a CD store, which is really, really awesome. We also built this store here, which was an expansion of the store that we had here, which was very small. And we also extended this one a little bit, so I kind of want to make the checkouts there like this store. So we can fit a lot more in there. And then that would be so much better because that store is very busy at the moment. But for today, I want to extend them all this way a little bit and put a new phone store. So I want all the newest phones and all that just in one store. So let's get a foundation let's start building i want to make this a little bit big so maybe maybe that yeah that would be big enough we'll also put the walls back because i don't want them to remove them there we go we'll also put doors here let's put double how should we do the doors maybe just like that just on the outsides i think that would be good yeah sure why not so, if I put a door here, I don't want people to just walk straight through. So, that's what I'm going to do. So, people are going to start building. Hopefully, they actually do it. But I want to make this storage for this store. So, it, it won't actually take too long to get there. At the moment, this is the end of the mall. And that's not really that good. Okay, they're building. That's why it's a little bit like... I have keep saying this each time... When they build, it becomes a little bit laggy, so I just speed it up a little bit and try to actually build it as fast as I can. So they're almost done here. After, well, before they do finish, I will get some tables, I think it is. Smartphones, yes, okay. So how are these? Okay, that's like that. I might do the same, but I'm not sure where I should put the checkouts. Okay, I'm going to put tables along here. Oh, that's pretty much perfect for that. And then we're going to put tables on this side. And then we could put it here as well. And then we'll put like, I want to put the queues in as well. Because I don't want them to interfere. Oh, okay. Should I do that? I don't really like this spot now. Um, like the checkouts there are nice. I think I might do that, what they have there. So if we get rid of like these three here. And we'll put like the checkouts. Oh, I kind of want to do it this side. No, I'm going to do it this side. This side is pretty good. So I'm going to put it right near the door, I think. So are they right? No, they're not. They're like here. So if we put one there, two, three. I think three is going to be enough, isn't it? We'll have to get rid of this one as well, that table there. Can you get rid of that table, please? Table on aisle three. Okay. I think I'm going to put it... There's not going to be that much demand for iPhone. Well, it's pretty much an iPhone store. Actually, I'm not going to put tables there. I'm going to put them here instead. I kind of want to rem like move it to the right one square. So I might do that. Oh, I don't know if I should though. I'm going to do it. So if we get rid of this row here, put some there, put some there. And then we'll have to get rid of this row. This row. Yes, that's good. Awesome. That's how I wanted it. I really wish it had like the same side, but there's a door there, so I can't do that. We'll have to assign it to a new store before we forget to do that. And we'll assign the doors as well. I don't really assign the doors, but I will now. We will fill in this store with four tile five. That's awesome for a iPhone store. Well, it's pretty much an iPhone store, a smartphone store. I should start saying smartphone. But if we start to put all stuff 
on the table, his smartphone. And then this is going to be like a TR3 store because this is the, like the first store that there's only going to be one product on it. Just smartphones. That's what I've been thinking over the last few days, ever since the last recording for this series. Been enjoying a lot more other games, but uh, this is probably my favorite game for now. Like there's Software Inc, there is Shell Shock, which is very awesome, but this is pretty much my favorite. Okay, can we continue to do all this? We'll have to actually make that 24 hours because I want to make this 24 hours. It just gives more profit. So let's get smartphones in here, smartphones in this one. There we go. Okay, what's all this? Parking. Wow, people. There's like 300 spaces for parking. How are, How is it full? I have no idea. And we've already done like 2.4 thousand sales, but only 22 thousand profit. That's how much the salaries cost. That's so much. There's so many sales coming in. Wow, I'm actually surprised there's that much. Store 28. Oh yeah, they kind of look full. But that's okay. I can always like hire more people in the future. And that's always full. That's been full since like day 3. And we're at day 122. So for now, I want to hire people here. So if we manage... Assign the storage to that store. That storage is going to become very busy very soon. Because there's so many stores coming in here. So, let's hire stock clerks first. This person's very good, but they're not fast. I want fast stock clerks so they can actually run to the storage area and run back. And they won't take that long. So, let's get... Three for now. I think three will do. So you can come in at that time. I should really put you on at eight o'clock. Because you're the fastest. You're the slowest. And you're just average. So there's always going to be one person on. Stocking the phones. And then we'll also need probably three on like eight o'clock and four o'clock. And then two cashiers on in the morning. Because I don't think it's going to be very busy. So if we get... You can come in in the morning, can't you? Because may as well. Okay, there's two people. Cashier, we'll put you at 8 o'clock. There's not really good cashiers. But I'll continue to put some in. We will get... They're terrible. Can't we, like, refresh? Because I would really like a refresh button with the people that are higher. Because there is not many people here that are very good. Like, you're a good stock clerk. Why can't I get you? Uh, should I? I'm going to do it. Yeah, I might do it. So, if we get rid of... One of these. What's the worst one? This person's the worst, but you're the fastest, so you can stay. You can actually go away. Let's fire you. Let's hire a stock clerk. This guy. You can come in at 16. I really should do, like, 14, but... I mean, 8 o'clock. Because you're, like, the best stock clerk. But I'm going to leave it like that. Okay, so cashiers. Let's get back on the cashier grind. So, we need one more cashier. Oh, you're a good builder. Really wish you popped up when we needed builders. So, that store should be open, I believe. Active. Yep, smartphones 100%. What are the needs on smartphones? Like, where are they? Electronics. Where's the electronics? There they are. Smartphones. Oh, there's a lot of demand for it, but... We have a new smartphone store, so that should pop right off. Sell smartphones in a store with over 50% of smartphones to satisfy this demand. Well, we have done that. It's 100%. 
fantastic. We should start seeing a stock clerk coming in, stacking the shelves as soon as this ticks over the like the next day. Or oh, janitors. That's what I was meant to be doing as well. So if we get some road work, I was going to put it like, I should really put it here so they don't block the traffic. Oh, sh where should I really put it though? The garbage. I really should get rid of this. So, you're pretty much the worst store here because you have to change your stock every day. So, I'm going to get rid of that. Actually, instead of that, we're going to put for here. Yeah, I'm going to do that. We need builders to actually get rid of that so we can actually put down garbage. We need garbage. So, when are the builders going to arrive? And I'm still on fast forward mode, so that's kind of bad. But, get rid of all their cars that are there. Hopefully they do. Every single spot here was used, but let's put that there. They can start building that as soon as possible. They look like they've done one, two, three. We're going to have four there. Awesome. Now, the janitors. Where's our closest maintenance here? You're just janitors. I may need another one. I might put it here. Right next to this door. I think that would be a good idea. Because I don't think you can put another loading zone. Oh, you can. Should I do that? No, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to put down a new maintenance center. Because it doesn't really need to be that big. They're not going to be there. They're just going to be like pretty much next door getting all the trash and all that. So we'll have to sign it as a maintenance center when we can. Whenever the builders arrive. There they are. So. Oh we also need a door because that guy is stuck in there now. Objects. Let's go with a staff door. Wherever the staff door is. There it is. We'll put it right there. Actually instead of there we'll put it right in the middle there just because it's in the middle for this we will have to hire janitors there's not really any good janitors okay this guy is he's slow though i'm gonna get him though they will get their job like really good so you can be a janitor i might get like a few of these how many should i get how many is that? I'm not too sure. Seven. I think seven's gonna be alright. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm just gonna keep seven. So that time, this time. Eight o'clock. You can come in at eight. You can come in at eight. I might get another one, just one more. Cause at the moment there is three people just in the actually, that's actually quite good. Now I'm going to get one more because I always want the rest of the day to actually be the same as when the store, like, when everyone comes in. That's what I'm trying to say. So hopefully this store continues to work. Oh, it's actually like a few days every time the food expires. So not too bad. So it's not going to be that terrible we have to fix some of these queues are full they do not look full but they will get full very soon parking eight people could not park at 1521 okay we need more car parks i think i might have to do it here but the car parks aren't even like full customer parking let's get some over here must be built on an existing road. Oh, I made this like one gap in between. I may have to fix that off episode. Yeah, I will have to. So I might not continue parking, like putting car parks here. Should I? I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, I'm not going to. So if we continue, what are these doors like? Oh yeah, they're making like five grand. 
Net profit, $104 lost. That's actually not too bad. What did you put down? You didn't even put down anything. But at least they stock clerks are like, there's people working here. How much was that? $71, $87. That's really nice. We are definitely going to make a profit. How's this store going? Because we built this in the last episode. It's not going quite well. Yeah, it's not going as good as the other stores. This store, I kind of want to get rid of the smartphones because I want them all to go to this store. But for now, I'm going to leave it and see how it goes. If it needs changing, I will. We need a better road network here because they all get stuck here. Always. They always get stuck. So how's this? I haven't like checked many stores lately. I kind of want to because if they take away a lot of profit, then that's not good. We are making profit on the bowling. That's fantastic. I did not know that. How's the movies going? They're actually making way more than the bowling and the bowling's a lot busier. I kind of want to move this store because yeah, we're making... Well, we're not making any more. We were making a lot. But this store. This store is what we need to change right now. I kind of want to close it. But I think I might... No, I won't close it. I will just have to build right near it. Checkouts. Where are you? There you are. So, one checkout goes into... I don't want to put it right next to the door. So we'll have to mix these up. Isn't that... Oh, that's going into the same queue, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh, that's bad. We don't want you there. You want to be there and then there. And then there. Okay, we have to change this up. There we go. And then we have to demolish all these after these are built. Because I don't want to demolish it before these aren't built. One built and then the builder just left. Alrighty. Get rid of all them. We also need to hire another person because that checkout's not being used. Objects. This. We'll have to put another one here, I think. Yep. One there, one there. I might not do that. Yeah, I'll put ten down. 10's a good number for checkouts. Five on each side. Okay, so we need to hire a lot more people because there is not many people being served here. So how many people? Four people in the morning. We can get a few more. Oh, you're a good janitor and you're speedy. So I kind of want to hire you as a janitor, but I don't I will may as well yeah may as well yeah we'll put you here as well so staff hire janitor we'll get you you can come in at sure that time okay let's get back to where we were this store here store number 18 you are the chemist far messy I think I spelled that right. If I didn't, then that can be changed. Forgot I didn't extend this, so you can be extended. There we go, to the door. Okay, there's a lot of people here, but there's not many check, like, what do you call it? Cashiers. There's not many cashiers here. Where is everyone? There's meant to be four here. No, there's meant to be 15. There is meant to be five here. I think everyone left because I moved to checkouts and they just left. But we are getting so many sales. Wow. Did not know we got that many. But let's hire some cashiers. So, we can hire up to 8. Well, 10. Yeah, 10. Don't know why I said 8. So, 6 in the morning. And then we'll hire a few more. We'll hire 3 extra... For the rest of the day, I think. So you can come in at 8 o'clock. Same with you. 
Same with you. So like six people and then it goes to eight. Yep. And then three more for the rest of the day. So 16. 16, which is four o'clock in the afternoon. Oh, we actually may need another person in the morning, but it doesn't seem like we do. Not, uh, not sure, not sure. The only bad thing about this store, very far from each storage. So, we can't really change that, can we? Yeah, it's not really in a good spot. But this arcade store, very good. One of the best arcade stores that I've made because that's the only one I've made. Parking, 100 people did not get the parking. Yeah, we definitely need to change that. I'll do that off camera because that lags the game and I really don't want to lag the game. It won't take too long. It'll take like five minutes. Not even. But for this door, I kind of want to move it. It's very busy. Yeah. I'm not sure what to do with that alcohol store. I kind of want to make it bigger. Like this size? No. Like that's pretty much the same size. Like like the deli. Or the clothing store. Like them sizes. Because this size is not big enough. With all the cashiers here as well. So let's go through some of these. Let's fix them all. Queues are full at the restaurant. They don't look full. There's only one cook. Okay. What are you doing? Hanging around. You're a cashier. Where? Why are you hanging around? Are you working here? If you're working here, why don't we have more cashiers? I'm quite lost on that. No idea. Well, let's get rid of that. Fast food restaurant. Oh, this is the fast food restaurant. Okay. 19 people left because queues are full. How many people actually work here? Okay, it doesn't come on until 8 o'clock. And there's meant to be two people here. There is one person not here. Who is not here? Come to work in 9 hours, 17 hours. Why are you not here? I will fire you if you're not going to come to work. So let's get another cashier. Let's get this guy. Eight. And then another one can be... Probably like this person. For their first job. There we go. Hopefully that fixes everything. Okay, it's a new day. That store closes. Alrighty. And they go through there. Why don't they go through this door? Why would they go through the toilet? No idea. Same with a janitor. No, you're just going out. Okay, are you going to come through here? No, you're not. Alrighty. Okay then, just walk away. Store number 12. What is this? Checkouts are full. They don't look full. Maybe because we've only got three. Wait, there we go. Why is there three people and there's only meant to be one person? This store... Okay, they just left two hours late. Wow. Alrighty. Do you have to be two hours late? I might hire another cashier, like, on each hour. Just so it's not full. So we need to hire two more cashiers. Hopefully I get good ones very soon because I really need them. Eight o'clock and then one more can go in at the rest of the day. So that store is not going to have a problem anytime soon. I don't think it's that busy. Store number 32. Checkouts are full. 28 people left. Alrighty. So what store are you? Household items. Oh yeah, we need another cashier probably in the morning. Actually, you're a stock clerk. No, you're a cashier. Alrighty. So we'll get a cashier. Pretty much that time. And we'll get another two for the other time zones. Because I don't want the same amount of cashiers on all the time. 24 hours. Because I don't think you need many cashiers right in the morning. Because 
Look how busy this is. We don't need like two, but I just hired another person to have three. So that store should be done. Pharmacy. Yes, I know about this because we did change this up. So that's going to be good very soon. Storm number 33. Nine people left. We can get another cashier. Stock clerk. Yep, you're good. Yeah, this is going to be a busy store. So there's one. Another one can come in at 8 o'clock. Another one can come in at 14. Which, who should I hire? You're very bad, but you're very fast. Yeah, I'll, I'll get you. You're very fast at coming to work. So we may as well get you. So, that's nine people. Store 31. Why are people leaving this store? Five people left. There's so many cashiers here and we're losing 1,000 a day. Oh my god. That is so many money going out. But we are actually making a lot. So there's going to be like... I may get another, just one more in the morning, that's all. Because I don't think we need it for the rest of the day. So you can come in at morning. Yes, I think that's good. I think that's good now. Yeah, there's like three, four cashiers on right now. There's going to be a lot more people coming in here in like a few seconds. Look at many people coming in. Yep, a lot. So everyone's coming in to work. That's good. Store 28. Yeah, we need to fix this. I'm not sure how to fix this because it's not a good store, is it? Um, what should I do? Kind of want to extend it, but I don't know if it's worth... Oh, it is worth getting a new store for it. Like a bigger one. But that's pretty big for this. No, no idea. If I do move it, I'll have to move it like into a bigger store and then probably extend the storage. Or like change the storage up with like another store. Because I don't think storages need to be very big. But I will get another cashier. Checkout counter. That wouldn't be too bad. So if I put like one here, it's not going to interfere with anyone, is it? Okay, can you not go there? Can you go there? There. Okay, you can't go right there. But I can go there. So that's going to have another cashier on this door. That's good. That's going to be awesome. So we need to get... There's going to be two people on at all times. I will get three people on at all times. So you can come in at 8. You can come in at 16. Yeah, three people on at all times. There's a random checkout like in the middle of this door. But it's going to work. In the future, I will have to change it up. So what's the next one? Restaurant. This store. What's happening here? Three people left. I will just get two more checkouts because we can fit it in. So if we get rid of that table and chairs and build some order counters we'll just be able to hire people we'll be able to hire two more cashiers on at all times and then they can actually serve a lot of people because apparently they don't want to be served they just walk out how's the cooks going yeah they're stacking up everything so let's get oh that's not going to be a good checkout though so, max Q size 2. Yeah, we'll get that. May as well. It's better than nothing. So, let's get two more staff members. One, two, three, four, two more. One, two. Okay, now we need to sort these out. So, you can come in at 14, 4 o'clock, I mean, which is 16. And then 8 o'clock, 8 o'clock. Wow, what is this? Like, this is not good for a, four people on in the morning. What happened here? Um, I have no idea. But 
Let's check all the cook cashiers. Okay, here. So zero, zero. No, you. Why do you come in at nine? You're meant to come in at eight. Sixteen, sixteen, zero. Why are you coming at six? Why are you coming at fourteen? Fifteen, sixteen, seven. You can come in at eight. Zero, zero, eight, eight, sixteen, and sixteen. You should all work perfectly now. Okay, this this can't be fixed. The deli can't be fixed. I'm not entirely sure what's wrong with it. And this can't be fixed either. No idea. Why are you very... You're very mad. Are you going to get served? I don't think so. No, you just... You're there. You're there. You did get served. Okay. Cues are full in the deli. Yeah, I know about this. I need to fix this up somehow, but I don't know how to. That's going to be a big project to do. Parking, 120. Yeah, I will fix that. Fast food restaurant. Wow, look at this. So many people here. Um, I can't really get more checkouts, can I? Unless I move the whole door there and get rid of this. It's going to stay like that, though. A lot of people here. Can't you just come into this checkout? Clothes are us. Are people leaving? Queues are full. What? Since when are queues are full? Queues are never full here. Cashiers. Yeah, you need probably one more person in the morning. And I just hired a good cashier. Let's get another one for the rest of the day, I think. So a good cashier. Yeah, may as well get you. There we go. That should fix it all. Restaurant again. They shouldn't leave. They must be very angry to leave. Close your ass. Pharmacy. Yeah, that's that's going alright. There's a lot of people serving. Store 25. There's a lot of checkouts there. If you're not getting served, don't know why. Fast food restaurant. This is going well. Yep. It's going well. Doesn't look like there's many people in queues. The deli still, yep. Can't access parking. Restaurants, two people left, not bad. Well, that is what we made today. A new smartphone. How? Oh, we're actually making a lot of profit. $5.9,000 a day. That is really good. What's our needs for the smartphones we may need another like three tables yesterday sales is 35 demand is 38 we can always get more so we'll get some tables can we rotate one two three one two three and then we'll just make them smartphones i think that would be good so we just need to wait until they are built there's two builders. That person's probably a lot faster. 53, and what are you? You're slow as. 20. Okay, we need to put down smartphones on here. Okay, that's two. Three. We should fit the demand now. Well, hopefully we fit the demand. Because if we have 31 smartphone tables... I'll be worried if it doesn't make a profit or fit the demand. But we made 4.8 thousand on this. That's awesome. But I'm going to leave this episode here. If you liked it, leave a like. Subscribe. We are almost at $2 million, which is awesome. Thank you for everyone watching this. And I will see you for the next episode. Thank you for watching.